With the raging weather creating havoc and claiming six lives at Mount Morosi, Lesotho Queen Masina de Bireng Seiso has visited victims of a devastating hailstorm and flash floods. Corporates and volunteers have raised close to a million rand to assist the victims. The Queen leading by royal example, she visited her subjects, victims of a devastating hailstorm and floods. This man is a single parent and has a household of six. He narrates his tragedy to the queen. He says it all happened very fast, hardly an hour and it was over. The entire storm had passed and now rain was pouring. The queen took a moment to address some villagers, offering them words of comfort. She says, I really just came to see you face to face and let you know that help will surely come soon. A short multi-denominational prayer service was held and a call to discuss issues such as climate change and in environmental studies. The Queen later joined donors who heeded her call to help the victims. As I alluded, I have been receiving calls from people who are eager to know how they can help or even visit Puting. We therefore, as patrons of the Red Cross, decided to set up a stall in the main shopping malls where people can pledge or donate as they see fit. We will in turn pass over the donations to Red Cross as they have necessary expertise to prioritize aid. Generosity has flowed following the monarch's call. As Vodacom, we would like to restore his house to a dignified condition. We will immediately make available 50,000 maluti. The Chinese community has donated blankets and support to taxi owners whose vehicles were damaged. I pray I don't want to see more hail here in Lesotho or anywhere else in Lesotho. Chief Tisila Masirubani is the candidate of Mount Morosi constituency. He welcomed the support. And South Africa has also pledged again to support uh, the people of Kuti to see that they come out of this turmoil. The loss of lives and the damage to property that has occurred in this place is truly unprecedented. But it is the pouring amount of help and the presence of Her Majesty that has eased the fears of the people that live in this place. Rapelang Khatebe, SABC News, 